What's going on everybody? This is Afro Think Tank. Today's video is going to be about uh, what what it is that we should call ourselves. What what is our title? You know, what what title would describe us as a group of people and what title should we as a diaspora gravitate towards as a unifying uh, as a unifying um, term or whatnot, right? And Africans Africans are very unique people because we Africans tend to come up with all sorts of names for ourselves, right? We're the only group of people who have so many names for ourselves and I think that also causes a lot of unnecessary division. On my channel, on my channel, when I say African or black, that means person of African descent, no matter where they are in the world, period, African. African. I'm an African. I am a African who was born in America. I am a American African. Even most Africans born in America live in black societies, black colonies basically, modern day black colonies together with the same group of people that they've been with for the last several hundred years. Like we are still in our own colonies, you know, as a group of people in America. And our America is different from everybody else's America. We live in a black America. We live in a African America. The America we built, the America we, we live in is different from everybody else's America. Even though it's the same landmass, it's not the same America. All right, so, uh, because there was a, a person in my comment section in one of my videos, and she said she was glad that I was defining what I mean when I say African. So I think it's important that a lot of people who are in this space, this new, I don't even know what we call this, uh, new age, woke YouTubers or uh, our enlightenment, like this is our time of African Renaissance, enlightenment, modern day info, whatever. I'm just, you know, this is something. Whatever we want to call it, you know, labels are important. Let's just keep it real, labels are important. And Europeans, they, they came up with the term, they come up with the term that unifies them under a conglomerate under one name it's called western all right western is just code word for white the western world because if you look at geography when they say western all the countries that they consider western they're not in the west <laughs> they're not all right they consider australia europe and america three different locations on the planet but all considered western countries right so even though europeans white people are all different they're not the same they're not the same at all all right but they found a way to unify under a term of western and they roll with it all right and it's accepted internationally is accepted on business-wise it's accepted everywhere like western that's just a term and they say it so easily no one even really bats an eye that western means white white dominated society white dominant white diaspora white european centric countries western all right so we, you know, as a group of people, if, if they got Western, what do we got? Africa. We're African. That's ours. Asians got theirs. Asians. They're just Asian. Even though there's various different types of Asians, they don't all, they're us in countries, they don't all get along. They all don't look alike. Indians don't look like Chinese, really. All right, Japanese and Chinese and Indians and, 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 and Taiwanese and, and, and Cambodians, they're all different. They're all eight considered Asian, but they're all definitely different. They all have different interests, and they definitely all don't get along with each other at all. But they're all Asian. They're Asians. It's the Asian world. They don't try to be anything else but Asian, right? They don't, you know, try to pretend to be any other group of people. They are Asian, right? So Africans, you know, it's more of us than anybody, you know, as a group. We should just call ourselves African or black, interchangeable. Black, you know, people get confused with the black. Yes, we're not, we're not a black color. Like, we know what black means. Black means, so for people who don't know what it means, it means person of African descent. It's the same, it's just like calling somebody an African. Black means African. You can be from Mozambique, you can be from Nigeria, you can be from Cameroon, you can be from Ethiopia, you can be from Eritrea, you can be from Somalia, you can be from Kenya, you can be from um, Tanzania. You're black, you're African, you're black. Yeah, you're a Tanzanian. Yeah, you're Somalian. Yeah, you Somalian, y'all black. I don't, I don't care what, well, y'all can say what y'all want. Y'all, look, y'all black. 
You can you can deny it all you want, but that's what you are. You're an African. You're black. Yes, you're mixed with you have add mixture with the um, the Asian, the the the, the Yemenis, the, the the Arab. You know that's because you you know your people conquered them a long time ago. Therefore, obviously they will be mixing, just like you know any place else, right? So, but you're black, all right? So, you know whatever. You know when I hear when I hear Africans or any other black person say that they're not African or black, I just look at them like, oh, you don't hurt my feelings because that's that's a insecurity in their brain because you can be as not, you can say you're not black or African all you want. That don't mean you're not. The facts don't change just because your opinion, just because you have a different mindset, you're still black. That's what you are. You're, you're African or a black person who's just in denial of reality, all right? But I think, Black Africans. Anytime, at least on my channel. I know there's other people. They, you know, they they dab around with Moors and and Israelites and all that. Whatever. Black. You black. You African. You black. Two different things. On my channel, black means black. So, so when I talk about a Nigerian or when I talk about an African American or when I talk about Jamaican or Brazilian, I'm talking about Africans around the world. And I put them all in one group because we are all one group. We're all one. At we're all African. You know, we're all one big giant family, you know, of people who are trying to get ourselves together. And that's how I carry it. When I see an African, I don't see a person different from me. I see a person who has different cultures from me. I see a person who grew up in a different uh, area than me. I see a person that speaks a, more, a few more languages than me. I see, I, that's what I see, but I also see my brother. I see my sister. I see someone I can relate to on a certain level. That's what I see. I don't see a different person. I see a family member, a black family member. That's what I see. No matter where you from, you black, I see family. All right, and that's how I'm rolling with. And that's how we have to be. You know what I'm saying? It's only, you know, we have to be family towards each other to a certain extent so we can get ourselves together and improve ourselves in, on this planet. You know, that's the only way we're gonna do it. Because if we divide it, we're just gonna keep fighting each other over names, over titles, over stuff that don't matter Why everybody else continue to take advantage of us. So that's all. That's all I really wanna talk about. It's not, I mean, it's important. It's not. It was important, not that important, not urgent, but I just think it's an important topic to talk about. So that's all I wanted to say, guys. Just Afro Think Tank, learn something, teach something. I'm out. Okay, thinkers, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Also, hit the bell icon for the latest notifications.